Welcome to our lecture online. To complete our understanding of dealing with the binomial expansion, let's just do an example of how to find any one term of any expansion. So in this case, we're going to take x plus y to the 15 power, and we're going to determine the sixth term, both the numerical coefficient and the exponents. And here we have the general formula. So in this case, we're going to replace k by 6. And so in this case, the sixth term is equal to n, which in this case is 15. The number at the bottom would be k minus 1. In this case, k is 6, so 6 minus 1 would be 5. And here we have x to the n minus k minus 1. So n is 15. I'll might as well just write the numbers down. 15 minus k minus 1. So if k is 6, k minus 1 would be 5. So 15 minus 5. And here we have y to the k minus 1, which is to the fifth power. So in other words, we're looking for 15, 5, and of course we have to expand that, x to the 10th power, y to the 5th power. One way to check to see if you didn't make a mistake in the exponents, the two exponents added together better add up to the exponent right here in our binomial expansion. Now we still need to solve for 15 and 5, like this, and we realize that's equal to 15 factorial divided by 5 factorial times 15 minus 5, which is 10 factorial. So this is equal to 15 times 14 times 13 times 12 times 11 times 10 factorial divided by 5 factorial, which is 5 times 4 times 3 times 2 times 1, and times 10 factorial. And right away you can see that the 10 factorials cancel out. There we go. Now we need to simplify things a little bit more. We have a 15 and a 5, that becomes a 1 and a 3. We have a 3 and a 3, that becomes a 1 and a 1. A 2 and a 12, that becomes a 1 and a 6. And a 4 and a 14, that becomes 7 and 2. And a 6 and a 2, that becomes 3 and 1. So we have 1's all the way down the denominator. And let's see what we have left in the numerator. In the numerator we have a 7 times a 13 times 3 times 11. Hmm. All right, that will take us a little work uh, without a calculator, but hey, I have a calculator handy, so let's do it quickly on the calculator. So we have 7 times 13 times 3 times 11, and that gives us 3,003. And so that's the number that goes in here, so this is equal to 3,003 x to the 10th, y to the 5th power, and that is how we find any term in any binomial expansion. So quickly check to see 7 times 13 times 3, 33 times 13, so 13 times 33 times 7, yep, 3003. And so that's how we do that. Mm -hmm.